contemplating. No cat ears on the headset this time. What happened to those? What's up? Oh, uh, they just... They're, they're gone forever. Aw, oh, they were my favorites. Actually, my favorites. All right, Dill versus Goober and his Toon Link. Toon Link versus Rob. An interesting matchup here. Pronounce Toon it C-H-O-O-M. Toon Link. Toon Link. M. Toon Link. Close enough. Anyway, <laughs> you commentate. I have to take your housekeeping. Of course, not a problem at all. Here, winner's quarters. We got Goober versus Dill. Obviously, uh, Rob, a very formidable character, one that actually has caused many people frustration. But Goober here with Toon Link has plenty of tools to actually zone out Rob. Dill, obviously, used to this, though. Taking a lot of damage, but Rob is a heavy character. More damage, more rage. Looks like Dill, unfortunately, with the miss input there. Actually going backwards on that little uh, top spin. Goober doing a fantastic job of just uh, zoning out with that boomerang. Using the floatiness to their advantage to try and catch uh, Dill in the air. Actually air dodging through that laser? Alright. Looks like Dill is trying to bring out those neutral airs. At 105, not quite kill range, but every little percentage of damage is going to count here. Especially as Goober goes against uh, one of Tri-State's most formidable raw players. If not the best one, I believe. Alright, doing a fantastic job just spacing with that Zare. Unfortunately catching a little bit of a forward air in that. Are you saying Dill is the best Rob in Tri-State when I'd, Zamba I'd, is literally here? I'd say one of the best. Not the best. Uh, I thought you said the best. No, like, no, no. Dill's no, no. good, but she's not <laughs> Zamba good. Alright, trying to catch Toon Link there. But that back air from Toon Link, gonna take it. Goober up one stock. Dill trying to cheese that out with a little top spin. Oh! Goober actually managing to mash his way out. Alright, the neutral air catching Goober. Getting a little scared there with the laser. But Goober just floating back. Trying to zone out with the arrows, the bombs. Oh, but the top there. Fortunately, not catching, but some great edge guarding there from Dill. Right at the top, back at the ledge. In hand. It's gone. Dill probably having to charge that up again. There it is. Goober doing a great job of stuffing it with the boomerang. Laser just to get Goober off. And, oop, forward throw. Dill going in deep. Not catching with that up air. Both swinging. Goober. Toon Link, a light character, actually living to 165. Not unheard of, but definitely uncommon. That up be multi hit, racking on a lot of damage, but it's not a kill move like regular Link's is. Goober up two stocks. That was There's... a really messed up obstacle course he had set up there. <laughs> yeah, looking like Toho out here. Oh my god. These, con these bomb conversions from Goober! My right, back throw. Is this gonna be a 3 stock? Oh! Alright, laser missing. Unfortunately, bouncing off the ground. Alright, the top. Getting them off ledge. Forward throw finally killing a 200% Goober unfazed. I love Rob's forward and back throw. Just how sudden they are. Right? Just like yeet. All right, Dill answering back here with the laser in the top. But these lingering up airs from Goober. That sword just stays out so long. All right, we got the Zeras back in play here. It's hard to say for sure from the gameplay, but it does look like Goober does not know how to pick up gyros. No, he has not been attempting to do that all game. Okay, I wasn't watching the whole time. No, no, no. Instead, he's been actually... Uh, I've been trying... No, he's been sucking them out with the boomerang instead. I've been trying to spread the information about that, but... Smash players, man. I mean, yeah, they don't listen. They don't hit they the don't, lab. They don't... Too late. All right. Running up Smash. Taking it. Looking like Mario out here. Yeah, with some fantastic patience there from Goober. Some great back airs, some great options here, just to rack on that damage against Look the... Look at all this nonsense that... Right! Look at all this nonsense that was going on. The bomb, the boomerang, another bomb. And the gyro. Don't Where's the gyro? And the arrow. And, and the, the arrow. And there's the, the gyro. Oh, there's the gyro. 
Oh my goodness. There's just so much going on. <laughs> Anybody would be overwhelmed by this. It's like, <laughs> oh yeah, everything. <laughs> oh, if that if that arrow hit, that would have been boomerang hit. That would have been right. insane. I don't think the boomerang would have killed, but definitely would have been a it would have been a confirm. To have that running up smash, great great presence of mind. Dill not let, actually letting go of shield there, but it was a uh, was a shield poke. Bro, he just ran. Oh no no, there we go. There was no shields. My mistake. All right, looks like uh, we might be running it back to uh, battlefield. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Three, two, I would have said something on PA, one, but. Go. I would have said something on PA. If I had one! Aww. Okay, we're actually going to small battlefield instead. This may give actually uh, Rob some, no, Toon Link some less options here to run away. Unfortunately, Rob will also have a few fewer options to get back on stage safely. Dill, playing very patiently, throwing out the gyro whenever possible. Goober's approach is actually being stopped at this time by it. Well, you know, if Goober's not going to catch uh, that spinning top, Dill is going to catch those bombs. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. All right, Goober. Spacing out confidently. The gyro scaring Goober into a top approach. Just managing that shield pressure. A great parry there from that laser. Making it back up. The up air not catching. It depends on the character, but tether recoveries are very good for avoiding the raw bed traps. Ah, uh, yeah. Edge guards. It does actually have a, a few frames of, of uh, invincibility, does right? Does he have a mash? He yes, has he a. Does. Oh my god! Wow! At 143, that hell might, of a mash. That might be faster than mine. Oh, you should ask the test. Oh my god, that back air taking it. Goober up one stock again. He might have something special. All I do is rotate the uh, stick with my palm. Aww. Uh, yeah, was not getting back. Goober just laughing it off. Getting back on stage and trying to throw bombs oh. until it finally catches Dill up in the air. No conversion. But he's telling Dill, hey, get down from there. The gyro actually extending that hitbox. Uh-oh. Dill wanted to go for something slimy there. <laughs> Look, you have to. You're up again. You're on stream. You gotta play confidently, stylishly. Both just waiting for each other. Keeping it stylish. Yeah. Oh, uh, if only Dante was in Smash. What? Mm -mm. Interesting clank. I've I've got the replay. Please, I want to see that. We can look at it after. All right, we have back air from Dill there. Rob's back air is meaty as ever. And Dill finally up one stock against Goober. All right, Goober's bomb play is not confirming as well as they did last game. Dill pressing their advantage as much as possible. Gyro missing. All right, bomb's out in play. You got oh, you got the Toho. Uh, you got the obstacle course again. Gyro beating out that boomerang for one of the first times this set. Unfortunately, even Toho cannot shoot projectiles through the stage. Unfortunately. When is, when is that going to be a gameplay option? Ugh. Kaizo Toho. Kaizo Toho? <laughs> okay. I'm sure there are some Super Mario World ROMs, ROM hacks that let you play Ka Toho oh. Super Mario World. That'd be amazing. Mario Maker 2 players, get on it. All right, catching a laser to the face here. Oh. That forward tilt from Toon Link does reach behind. It would be a good option if he was just a little bit closer. All right, Goober trying to avoid being between a gyro and a rob place. Gets a bomb out, tosses it up, trying to create some pressure here. Rob actually catching that bomb to the face. Look, you can't avoid everything forever. All right, try pulling down. Goober trying to be as patient as possible. That four throw, not enough to kill just yet. It really only kills a 200 plus, as we saw last game. Unfortunately, a sour spot there from the back air. 
Not gonna kill Dill just yet. His movement's restricted because he doesn't know how to deal with Gyro. Oh no. Oh! oh. oh. Alright. Presumably an up throw from Dill could have finished that, but... Yeah. Okay. Still living. Choom Link. Wow. Alright, Choom Link still living to 186. Alright, Dash Yo, not, Attack not gonna take not it. Not Choom Link. Sorry, Choom. Choom Link. Link. All right, another arrow. Oh, the what? neutral is finally I, gonna take it. Listen, I don't mind that it kills. What I mind is that there are like, hit, there are like ten different hitboxes with ten different properties on where that nair sends you, <laughs> and I don't understand which one is which. We don't have to. We just have to know that it works magic. As you can see here, this was the the first lock against Goober. Okay, let's see what happened here. Yeah, what was this weird clank? Okay. No, no, he's gonna, she's gonna pick up the gyro. Right. And then the boomerang. Oh! Wait! It was the shield! Yeah, huh? it, it clanked no, I with know. the shield. Wait, it's not because... Hold up, look. He yeah, was in forward air landing line. Right. Are oh. you kidding me? Oh, I see. Are you it, it kidding the me? the shield as it was, he was holding it back. Amazing. That is, that is not... No! No! <laughs> That's clip worthy. No! Gotta love that C axis. Choomling! <laughs> Choomling. Absolutely being saved from death on that one frame. Oh, point for Dill. Alright, it is now 1 1. Even set. Both players on a winner's bracket points. Alright, both trying to space each other out here. Dill playing a lot more aggressively here with the gyro. Feeling confident after that last game. And Uber trying their best just to keep that gyro out of their life using the boomerang. Boomerang has been most effective at actually stopping that gyro. Oh, but letting go of shield was a mistake. Cast Tower Man, thank you very much for the follow. Love you, appreciate you. Sub if you can. All right, got bombs on deck. Bombs and bombs and bombs. That gyro actually extending that hitbox once more. All right, both trying to find an opening. Goober finally dashing in. Boomerang catching, no conversion. Uh-oh. <laughs> Dill jumping for dear life, trying to avoid all the projectiles. The gyro coming in clutch. Okay, that back air finally taken that. Dill up one stock. Goober trying to throw some more bombs into here, trying to see if anything catches. Hey, there can only be two bombs at once there, Goober. Can't try pulling out three. Alright, that neutral air is a multi-hit from Toon Link, but it does have a very short range. Better use as a surprise than actually an approach option. Dill fails to pick up the gyro. Nair? Yeah. Landing uh -oh. on a platform with Nair, such that the uh, Nair hitbox is pointing straight downwards, is such a powerful landing option. Oh. Even if you parry it, it's not a guaranteed punish in that situation. It's just so safe. If you want any hope at a punish, Rob has to be up. No! I mean, it is a multi-hit, but Dill, Dill is not going to let go of that. You, you can just shield through it. Uh-oh. I just jumped that whole time. Hey, that is one of your most precious resources. Don't jump if you don't have to. Forward smash. Goober recognizes how much lag that move has if you whip it. 43 frames after the 43? final hit. 43? Oh my god. It's an insane amount of lag. You can just set up a smash attack. It's not that hard. Wow. All right. Great grab there. All right. Dill avoiding that bomb. Now has to avoid everything else. Great shield there on the gyro from Goober. At 108, has to play very carefully, trying to avoid back air oh my from God. neutral air. I saw that, but unfortunately came out too late. Uh oh, he's gonna have to mash for his life again. Wait, he didn't mash that time. Nope. How strange. Yeah, maybe he's going for a mix-up. But there is no mix-up. You just get out. <laughs> well, if, can't you stall? No, if your mash is fast enough, you get out and Rob can't get you. Ah, no, but I mean, like, if you're anticipating to mash out, if you wait. I right? guess, but yeah. he's out. He's just out with the right mash. Ah. Like, that's the thing about Rob's down throw. If you mash fast enough, there is no mix-up. Ah, you'll learn something new every day, folks. 
At least I did. All right, here we go again. Another match. Case in point. There you go. That was a 156. He's probably still dead, but... Oh, unfortunate. Goober trying to, trying to collect themselves again. Trying to at least go for one more stock here. Oh my god. Wow. Unfortunately, that Phantom Footstool messing up that combo. Dill taking advantage. Big laser? Big laser. Dill playing very patiently, just waiting for Link to approach. Holding shield. It's looking small. Not a lot of defensive options left. Neutral air back on stage from Link. All right, those arrows rarely coming out this game. All right, Gyro just buying Toon Link. But Goober doing a great job of just staying near the ledge. Trying to catch with a forward tilt. Oh. All right, Gyro. Oh, that's, that's dangerous. Makes oh, yeah. it back. Doing a good job shielding that up air. Whoa! All right, forward tilt taking it. Surprising amount of damage. Even Dill just laughing at it. And right, Goober trying to set something, some defensive options up with that boomerang. Uh, does he still have his jump? Does not. Doya! Oh! Makes Shoot. it back! All right. This is the moment when they maybe uh, spend their last nine lives. Look, just because he has those eyes doesn't mean he's a cat. Meow. I mean, he does meow like a cat. <laughs> All right, both trying to throw everything. Right. Maker's such a charming little game. Anyway. Right? Oh my god. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Alright, Toon Link. Can't have the combos, but Grab unfortunately me. so light. Dill really wants that up <laughs> <Yeah>. throw. <laughs> Dill just being like, yeah, yeah, yeah. A little head bob there. Alright. Goober living to 200%. There, but no hit. Oh my god. Alright. Yeah, at this point, even something like freaking Rob forward air is He's at risk back. of killing it. He 200. didn't hear no bell. Oh Ooh, god, the gyro right. again! Gyro. I mean, still living, still living. No! Oh my god! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> he disappeared. Oh man. True. Look at those two right. having a good time, both not believing at all that they lived for that long. Uh, can, oh, we, that was... can we go see those replays again? That was incredible. Oh, whoops. Wrong replay. No, it's replay. all good. As we can see here, both are just trying to space each other out with the bomb, the gyro. Trying to find an inch. That back air, actually, wow. Taking both the first stock and the last stock that game. What a fantastic punish from Goober there. Like you said, what is it, 44 frames? 43. I don't know the exact number. It's just a lot. Punish Rob thusly if he does a side B and doesn't hit you and is still on stage. It's unfortunate that he did miss the up B there. Just, just barely shorts. I'm right, trying to fish for that uh, forward. <laughs> there we go, the forward tilt finally taking it. And just fighting for and dear lives. Is that a record for Toon Link? I feel like that's got to be a record for Toon Link. 230.1. Nice. Ooh. <laughs>